birthday to me. <laughs> I got my birthday bunny here. <laughs> well, howdy, y'all. That, for, welcome to 3 for Friday, number 113. I'm Bunny Barnes, and that, according to the Guinness World Book of Records, is the most recognized song in the English language. It's been translated into 18 languages, and the melody comes from a song, Good Morning to All. Who knew? It was attributed to American sisters Patty and Mildred Hill in 1893, although the claim has been disputed. It's now in public domain. And but but Warner Chapel Music had claimed the copyright and collected licensing fees up until 2015 when it was declared invalid and they had to pay back $14 million in licensing fees. Fun, fun facts. Only you'll find them only here, folks. <laughs> First person in the room, Rhonda Scott Merrick. Thank you. It's good to have seen you today. And Mike Verbeck, thank you so much. Hey, Slim, nice set. I'll go back and catch the last tune when I'm done. And Jan Anderson, yay. You made it, thank you. Thanks for the birthday wishes, everybody. Hey, Ken Nashif. Yep, all of them are special. Any day with my toes on this side of the grass is a good day. 73 this year. Woohoo! Who would have sunk? Hey, Dave Mason, from across the pond. Thanks for coming all this way. And you too, Chris Brown and Trisha, all the way from the UK. Thanks so much for coming. Rudiger Krasewski, vielen Dank. Das freut mich. Freut mich, dich zu sehen. And Craig Osterberg made it. Good morning. Good morning. Where where are you that it's morning? Mm. Okay, it could be morning for you. I mean, I, I my morning is at noon, so, yeah. Hey, Robin Gray. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. And Johnson Jackie Hogg made it. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much. April is a good month for a birthday. I think so. Hey, Ann Stevenson, thank you very much. Good to see you here. And Mike Alford, E-Tango Israel. Is that you, um, Alexi? I think it might be Alexi. I can't quite see the picture. Thanks for coming. Yo. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you so much. And Judy Wong made it. Thank you so much. Oh, <laughs> both pages come up, and, and I'm not using that other page anymore. I should make it inactive, but I'm afraid if I make it inactive, Facebook will find something wrong with this page again, and I don't know. I'm, like, really superstitious about it right now. Hey, Stephen Ruprecht. Thank you for coming by. You can, you can write in either page, but I don't really check the other page anymore. The one with the pink scarf has pretty much gone inactive and I I guess people are writing to it but I, I have to go through all kinds of rigmarole to get to it. I have to log out of this page and then log into the other page and so I haven't been really checking that page with a pink scarf. I should inactivate it, huh? Finger style and fun facts. You got it. <laughs> Andrea, you made it. Hello. Österreich, das freut mich sehr. Ist später, ja, ich weiß schon. Afternoon, five o'clock somewhere. That's right, Greg. It is. Hey, Ronald Cats, thank you so much. So, um, because we had the eclipse, I thought I would play you my moon medley. How many of you saw the eclipse? We got about ninety percent of it. Some of you in in Ohio got to see to totality. That was a new word for me. Got to see a total eclipse. Wow. Um, my friend drove up to, uh, my friend Arlene drove up to uh, Quebec, no, Quebec, Niagara Falls, to see the total eclipse. And it was cloudy all day except when the eclipse happened. We got to see about 90%. And um, I got a couple of pictures of, of just a little um, crescent moon, or crescent sun, I guess it was. And um, hi, Michael Nagasaki, Nagasaka. Greetings from York. Thanks for coming over. That's a far way to come. Totally in Vermont. In Vermont. Cool. 
It, I bet it was amazing. The day after your birthday. Wow, that's a heck of a celebration. Thank you all for coming. So, um, yeah, we did get to see a little bit. So I thought I would play my moon. Hey, time travelers, too. Sue is watching. Sue gave me these wonderful earrings for my birthday. Aren't they fantastic? I love them. They kind of give me percussion on the guitar. But if I sit up, I'm good. So I'm wearing them today, Sue. Thanks for watching. Hi, Mary. And Izzy's there. Cool. So, yes, because we had the eclipse, I thought I would play my moon medley for you. The first song was composed by Percy Wenrich and lyrics by Ed Madden in 1912. The earliest recordings were by the American Quartet and Dolly Connolly. The second one is a popular love song composed by Gus Edwards with lyrics also by Ed Madden. And it was first published in 1909. And performed on stage by Lillian Lorraine in the Zigfield Follies. The third one was credited to uh, the married vaudeville team of Nora Bays and Jack Norworth. Jack Norworth wrote Take Me Out to the Ball Game. This is 1908. And the three songs were from a series of moon-related songs from the Tin Pan Alley era. Tin Pan Alley was a couple blocks in New York um, around 28th, West 28th between 5th and 6th Avenue near Broadway, where a lot of publishers set up their shop. And um, they all had these these uh, upright pianos. And what they would do would be to put a piece of paper in between the strings. So what, when the hammer hit the strings, it sounded real honky-tonk and like a tin can. So they took the words tin, can, and piano, and they came up with Tin Pan Alley. Fun facts. Gave it a more percussive sound that way. And so um, th that um, this is going to be my medley of Moonlight Bay, on Moonlight Bay, by the light of the silvery moon and shine on harvest moon. And in that one, I'm going to include that seldom heard verse.
here. <laughs> honey's here. <laughs> Thanks, honey. Well, thank you guys. What did I miss? I can't think of any better way to spend my birthday. Here we go. Let's go back. I got Ron Kratt. I got you guys. Yep. Here we go, David Falcone. Hey, you did a great set today. I was really enjoying it. I was really mellow out with that. You had some really fabulous homeward bound and, and the landslide. Wow, such great tunes you played today. And that lullaby, the, was it lullaby for Laura? Oh, wow. Lauren, maybe? Um, that last tune was just stunning. Yeah, David Falcone. I shared him on my page. You can go watch him. Go back and watch him. Mike Verbeek's here. You went to Ohio for the eclipse. Wow. Wow. I bet it was totally awesome. Yeah, I'm going to have to wait another 20 years. I'll be 93. What are the chances? Jens Hausmann. Christy. Hello. Vielen Dank. Das freut mich. Aus Deutschland. Ah, toll. Thanks for coming. Hey, Joe Owers. I so appreciate all the birthday greetings. Ron, thank you for harmonizing. I can actually hear you doing that. Silvery Moon. Yeah, that was a fun, fun medley to play. Hey, John Montanez. Oh, is it really nice out there? It's really kind of dreary here. We had the sun for a little bit, but it's been raining most of the day. Um, and then the sun came out just for a little bit. I hope it's really nice in Pacific Grove. Oh, Bad Moon Rising. Wow, that's a little hard for a solo instrumental guitarist. Not today, for sure. But I'll keep it in mind, Stephen. Hey, David Bjornsgaard. That What was that crazy chord in the turnaround? This, uh, I don't know, here? Or this? Just an E7. I don't know. It's on YouTube, so or you can go back and um, go back to the to the recording and send me a message as to what time it was in the recording, and I'll go look. How's that? Uh, I you know I thought about Blue Moon, Rhonda. Um, my my this the mutant little finger is not quite up to it this week, but I'll work on it. Maybe I can get it for next week. We'll see. Ah, uh, thanks. Thanks, Jens. That means so much coming from another guitarist. And you're so good. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Hey, Robert Marcello. Good to see you. I think you're in Jersey, right? Marcia Frank. Thank you. Thank you for the good fish wishes. Rhonda says, hi, honey. We've been a little shaky with honey lately. Had another fall yesterday. But nothing broken. So we're, we're open. Dark side of the moon. Yeah, right. Oof. But that's tough. Thank you, Slim. I do love the medley. Yeah, I thought about moon dance too. I don't know that one yet, but I think that that's going to have to be on my to learn list. I love that tune. And it's, it's a really, really great tune to play at gigs too. And thank you for sharing. Cold and rainy on Saturday. Mm. Well, thanks so much. I, I really appreciate uh, the, the good words. I do I do uh, play Moop Blue Moon, but I, I won't do it this week. But I'll look at next week. So let me tell you uh, some more things. Let me encourage you to share if you haven't already. And um, I promise I'll check out the comments on the break. Um, afterwards, I do have to take some stuff for him to the hospital, but um, I'll come back and I'll, I'll check the comments. Uh, thanks, Toby Simmons, getting me friends like John Montanez on my stream. Uh, John wouldn't have known about me without Toby, so thank you. And to my invisible friends, say hello to Kitsari Kaku, Bob Salzberg, Craig Petrin, Daryl Anderson, whom I know from David Falcone, uh, Joel B. J. anybody else. If I'm not saying hello to you or reading your name, then it, you could be invisible to Ecamm if you're watching it while it's live. And I don't say your name. Let me know. And I'll add you to my invisible list. Last night I shared the Red Door Duo. Helen Avakian and David Irwin did a, a great live um, 
had shared on my stream uh, for, um, and they did all these moon songs, moon and sun songs. Uh, and they did a, a great version of a tune I'm going to do today too. So that's on my, on repeat. And then uh, today, David Falcone's on my newsfeed. Stevie Coyle's there. Slim Edelman's there on my newsfeed. I think I shared you, Slim. I think so. If not, I'll go back and do it. And then um, I shared Raleigh from last Wednesday. And um, look out for Warren Bendler. He's going to be on Saturday at 3. Warren Bendler Saturday at his Folky Fridays on Saturday. Meredith and Greg will be back Saturday night. Look for Meredith Axelrod's page. And then Raleigh Brown will be back on Sunday for his all request show. And then Muriel Anderson will be back Monday live at 7 p.m. Don't miss her. She's always got some great things. I'm going to be opening for Muriel. Hey, Toby Simmons. Thanks for coming in. I just thanked you earlier. Thanks for coming on. Appreciate it. You're a busy girl now. I know. So I do appreciate you tuning in to me. Um, Muriel, yeah, so Muriel's going to be uh, doing a show in... Uh, Gilbertsville, PA, on Mother's Day, and I'm going to be opening for her. So that's very exciting for me. Thank, I want to thank Carl Brownfield for playing my tune still on KGFN.org on the Carl Shop Show. If you want a good old-timey folk music show, go to KGFN.org and look for the Carl Shop Show from Goldfield, Nevada. And Rusty and Jan are still playing my tunes on the Philly folk scene, pr promoting myself and a lot of other local artists. Um, phillycam, phillycam.org or WPPM Radio. You can listen to the replays of them as well. And um, next Saturday, I have a gig at, not this Saturday, next Saturday, the 20th, I'll be back at the New Hope Winery. They canceled my last gig that was on Easter Eve. Um, they closed early. So I'm really excited to get back to them. That'll be on the 20th from 5 to 8. And I do hope to do a live stream next Friday, too. So look for my three for next Friday. And the QR code will take you to my, my CD. It'll also take you to this nifty new, looks like a credit card, but it's a USB port. And on here are all of my tunes in MP3 files, uh, WAV files. All the liner notes are here as well. And the... Uh, the original cover and um, there's a welcome video there's a photo gallery with lots of pictures of me and me with other artists and also four videos from tunes that I play on the CD from the Chet Atkins convention so um, check that out if it's the same price as the CD and you get a whole lot you can put it into your car you can plug it into your computer so, thanks so much. Hey, to be freed. Yeah. The birthday girl's right here. <laughs> okay. Yeah, me too. So, um, here's another Moonlight-related song for you. And it was first released in the, U the UK. This is the one I heard Muriel play the other night. In USA, it was released in 1971. Written by Cat Stevens, known also as Yusuf Islam in 19 since 1971. He was in Spain, sitting at the water's edge, and he was watching his shadow in the glow of the moon. And Mira did a great arrangement of this. I'll to, maybe I'll talk her into playing it with her. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe on uh, Mother's Day I can play this with her. Here's my arrangement of Moon Shadow. <laughs>
Moonshadow. Thanks, Henny. That's a fun tune. I really like that. He's out there. So, thanks so much. Um, wow. Jeff Eubanks. Hey, thanks so much for coming in. Appreciate it. Good to see you come into the room. I missed Robin Gray. Did I say Robin Gray? Are you here? I missed you. Oh, or I just don't remember. It's that memory thing. You know, you get old. That's what happens. Thanks you. Thanks so much. Um, there was a, something else that I saw in here. Oh, you got thunder going on? Thank you, Dave. David. Learn much from, I so learned so much from you too. Yeah, you were, you're, you are inspiration for me as well. So, um, let me, let me, you know, uh, also say that, you know, you can't have an eclipse without the sun, right? So I had to put a sun song in here. And, you know, this is a tune that's a really old tune. It was written by Jimmy Davis and his guitar player, Charles Mitchell, in 1940. Some claim that Paul Rice actually wrote it, and Bing Crosby was the first one to have a hit with it in 1941. Let me clunk, everybody. Cloink. So Bing Crosby was the first one to have a hit in 1941, and it went to number 20. It was also on the B-side of Hank Williams' signature song, Your Cheatin' Heart. In 2000, it was the soundtrack of Oh Brother Where Art Thou, recorded by Norman Blake. You know, I play in these, um, in some of the nursing homes, uh, Philadelphia Protestant home I go to, and I play on three different floors, and I, I just take a cart and move from one floor to the next, and uh, the, the the condition of people gets worse as you go from one floor to the next. But this is a tune that everybody always sings. It doesn't matter what condition they're in, they're always singing this one. Here's You Are My Sunshine. some people coming in here. Thanks. Thanks for the clink. Hey, Sharon March. Thank you. Thanks for coming in. The bunny doesn't have a name. She's Today, she's the birthday bunny. I, I haven't named her yet. She's my spring bunny, though. I'm going to put her outside in the, under the cover of the porch. <laughs> Thanks, Stephen Ruprecht. Appreciate that. Hey, James Potter, thank you so much. I appreciate the good comments. Thanks so much. Thanks, Johnson. 
it means a lot coming from you. You're you're such an excellent guitarist, I, and Stephen too. All of you guys. I mean, I'm I'm humbled to be playing in your presence, and um, you know I couldn't think of a better better way to spend my birthday except being with my friends in this room. Like it was, I was a, I was pretty depressed with this birthday coming up and just things are not working out the way I would have hoped. And um, then I thought, you know, I'm gonna be with so many friends this birthday in the room. So it means a lot to me that you came today. Letting the guitar be my voice heals my soul. And I so hope that my music makes you happy because it sure makes me happy to play for you. Thanks so much for coming today, and I'll see you next week. Number 114, same time, same place. Love y'all. Take good care. Bye-bye.